Snakes are some of the most feared animals in the world, mainly because of the many ways it can dispatch its prey. But by far the most terrifying way is with the use of venom, a chemical cocktail that has a myriad of adverse effects which often lead to death. Number one has gained the reputation of having the deadliest venom of all snakes, so make sure to stay tuned for that one. Join us now as we give you the top 10 most venomous snakes in the world. Let's begin, shall we? Number 10. Rattlesnakes. If you're from the Americas, more specifically Arizona, you'll be glad to find out that this is the only snake from your neck of the woods that made it on this list. The rattlesnake is easily identifiable by the telltale rattle on the end of its tail. They're actually a part of the pit viper family and are capable of striking up to two-thirds of their body length. The eastern diamondback is considered the most venomous species in North America. Surprisingly, juveniles are considered more dangerous than adults due to their inability to control the amount of venom injected. Most species of rattlesnakes have hemotoxic venom, destroying tissue, degenerating organs, and preventing blood clotting. Some degree of permanent scarring is very likely in the event of a venomous bite, even with prompt, effective treatment, and can lead to the loss of a limb or even death. Difficulty breathing, paralysis, drooling, and massive blood loss are common symptoms. Thus, their bites are always a potentially fatal injury. Untreated rattlesnake bites, especially from larger species, are very often fatal. However, anti-venom, when applied in time, reduces the death rate to less than 4%. Number 9. The Death Adder They don't call these guys Death Adders for nothing. This highly venomous snake found in Australia, of course, and New Guinea. They actually specialize in hunting and killing other snakes, including some on this list, usually via ambush. Death Adders look quite similar to vipers in that they have triangular shaped heads and short squat bodies. Small as they are, they pack quite a punch, and it's very fast, too. With the quickest strike in the world, a Death Adder can go from strike position to striking and back again, particularly due to the relatively slow progression of symptoms. But before its development, a Death Adder bite had a fatality rate of 50%. Number 8. Vipers. Vipers can be East and Central Asia, particularly India, China, and Southeast Asia. But no matter where in the world they came from, vipers are quick-tempered and generally nocturnal, often active after rains. They're also very fast, like many of the other snake species we have here. Most of these species have venom that cause symptoms that begin with pain at the site of the bite, immediately followed by swelling of the bitten body part. Bleeding is a common symptom, especially from the gums. There is a drop in blood pressure and the heart rate fails. Blistering Bite victims also report excruciating pain that lasts anywhere from two to four weeks. Fortunately, there is anti-venom for most viper venom, or even later. Number 7. The Philippine Cobra Found exclusively in the northern provinces in the Philippines, the Philippine Cobra is a snake greatly feared by locals, and with good reason. Drop for drop, its venom is the deadliest of all the cobra species, and they're capable of spitting it up to 3 meters. The venom is a neurotoxin which affects cardiac and respiratory function, and can cause neurotoxicity, respiratory paralysis, and death in 30 minutes. They can be found in low-lying plains and forested regions, along with open fields, grasslands, dense jungle, agricultural fields, and human settlements. They have a sort of love-hate relationship with farmers because even though they're quite deadly, they're also quite effective in controlling the vermin population. They predominantly prey on small mammals, frogs, and even other snakes. Small rodents such as mice and small rats are their preferred prey and make up the majority of their diets. However, they will also eat other sizable snakes, small lizards, frogs, eggs, and when the opportunity arises, small birds. Number 6. The Mainland Tiger Snake Found along the southeastern coast of Australia, from New South Wales and Victoria to Tasmania and the far corner of South Australia, the venomous mainland tiger snake has a very potent neurotoxic venom. Symptoms can include localized pain in the foot and neck region, tingling, numbness, and sweating, followed by a fairly rapid onset of breathing difficulties and paralysis. They are responsible for the second highest number of bites in Australia, as they inhabit highly populated areas along the east coast, including some metropolitan areas on Melbourne. Depending on where they're found, they will eat various types of frogs, lizards, birds, and mammals. They are attracted to farms and other suburban homes, where they hunt mice nocturnally and can easily be trodden on by unsuspecting victims in the darkness. Bites are fatal if untreated, causing pain in the feet and neck, tingling, numbness, and sweating, followed by breathing difficulties and paralysis. 
The venom also damages the blood and muscles, leading to renal failure. Number 5. The Black Mamba Black Mambas aren't only one of the most venomous snakes in the world, but also the fastest land snake in the world. They've been blamed for numerous human deaths, and African myths exaggerate their capabilities to legendary proportions. For these reasons, the Black Mamba is widely considered the world's deadliest snake. Found in many parts of Africa, they are Africa's longest venomous snake, reaching up to they then spread their cobra-like neck flap, open their black mouths, and hiss. If an attacker persists, the mamba will strike not once, but repeatedly, injecting large amounts of potent nero and cardiotoxin venom with each strike. Before the invention of black mamba anti-venom, a bite from this fearsome serpent was almost always fatal, usually within about 20 minutes. Unfortunately, anti-venom is still not widely available in the rural parts of the mamba's range, and mamba-related deaths remain pretty frequent. Number 4. The Malayan Blue Crate The Malayan Blue Crate is a highly venomous but common species that occurs in peninsular Malaysia, Thailand, Singapore, and Sumatra in Southeast Asia. It is probably the most venomous snake found in Asia, and it ranks among the deadliest snakes in the world. This type of snake lives in a wide variety of habitats, often close to a water source. Amongst their preferred habitats are rocky areas and waterways, but it also inhabits deciduous shrubby areas with sandy soils, hill forests, primary evergreen forests, or plantations. How dangerous are they? Well, very apparently. According to surveys conducted throughout Southeast Asia and Indonesia, 50% of bites from the deadly blue crate are fatal, even with the administration of antivenin. The venom is a neurotoxin, 16 times more potent than that of a cobra. It quickly induces muscle paralysis by preventing the ability of nerve endings to properly release the chemical that sends the message to the next nerve. This is followed by a period of massive cramps, tremor, susceptible to permanent coma, and even brain death from hypoxia. Number 3. The Eastern Brown Snake The Eastern Brown Snake is a venomous species of reptile that lives in Australia and New Guinea. It prefers to live in dry areas so it can be found in the grassland, scrubland, and sparse forests. It's so venomous that only 1 out of 14,000 of an ounce of its venom is enough to kill an adult human. It is also very fast and can be aggressive under certain circumstances and has been known to chase aggressors and repeatedly strike at them. They're so dangerous that even juveniles have been known to deliver fatal bites to humans. Unfortunately, its preferred habitat is also along the major population centers of Australia. The venom contains both neurotoxins and blood coagulants. Fortunately for humans, less than half of bites contain venom and they prefer not to bite if at all possible. They react only to movement, so stand very still if you ever encounter one in the wild. Now it's time for today's best pick. Today's pick is a snake that you shouldn't even think of approaching, because not only does it pack a nasty bite, it can also spit the venom right at your face. Find out what it is next with number 2. The Mozambique Spitting Cobra The Mozambique Spitting Cobra is a very common snake in Africa with a very potent venom. The species accounts for many snake bites and for that reason it is considered one of the most dangerous snakes in Africa. They are found mostly in lowland forests and moist savannas, where it prefers broken, rocky country, hollow logs, and termite mounds and animal holes. They are often found close to water sources, to which it will readily retreat if disturbed. These snakes seldom stand their ground. If cornered, it may spread its hood. However, its main defense, other than retreating into hiding, is to spit out its venom with uncanny accuracy. Although their fangs are specifically designed for spitting, they also bite in some occasions. 50 milligrams of their venom is fatal to humans, and on average, a single bite can contain 180 milligrams of this toxic substance. A bite that doesn't receive early treatment will result in major tissue damage and prolonged hospital stay to repair the damage by skin grafts. But with early administration of anti-venom, the extent of tissue damage may be reduced and fatalities are rare. Before we move on, do me a favor. My analytics show that only about 15% of you watching are actually subscribed. Come on guys, what's up with that? Can you guys please hit the subscribe button? You guys watch my videos every day anyway, so you might as well subscribe and keep up to date with every video we put out. Number 1. The Inland Taipan The undisputed king of all venomous snakes is the Inland Taipan. It has the most toxic venom of any land snake in the world. But believe it or not, there has never been a single recorded human fatality from a bite of this snake. It is a large. More often than not, if approached, it will retreat into its shelter. 
Inland taipans are mammal specialists, meaning they only eat mammals, most commonly rats. The snake corners the rat in its burrow or in deep cracks in the soil, then bites it quickly several times without releasing it. The venom acts so quickly that the victim does not have time to fight back. The venom of the inland taipan is by far the most potent. Would you consider keeping a pet snake? Let us know in the comments section down below. Want to watch more videos about deadly animals? Click on any of the videos you see on your screen. As always, thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time. Later, everybody.